process's terrible and senseless choice of committing this the murder requires the court to impose the most severe penalty that can be imposed in our state. That is life imprisonment without the possibility of parole. First at six, a convicted killer has learned his punishment for the shooting and killing of his ex-girlfriend. As you just heard, a judge sentenced Luis Bernal Sosa to life in prison without the possibility of parole. Joining us now with more from today's hearing, News 8's Brittany Flowers. Brittany. Sue and Brian, in February, a jury found Bernal Sosa guilty for the murder of Leah Gomez, a 22-year-old mother who was shot several times as she sat in her parked car. It happened May 31st of last year along Commerce Avenue Southwest in Grand Rapids. Bernal Sosa brought out an AR-15 wrapped in a blanket, walked up to Gomez's car and fired seven rounds into the vehicle. Her 21-month-old daughter, who was in the back seat, was not hurt. During sentencing today, Gomez's grandmother and grandfather both spoke, and shortly after, so did Bernal Sosa through a translator. My question is, is why didn't he think of the consequences that were going to take place when he did what he did? He not only hurt his daughter, he hurt her family, Leah's family, and he, I'm sure he also hurt his own family. My intention was to threaten her, not to kill her. But like her grandfather said, there is a God. And God is the one that has the last word. Gomez's daughter, who will be three in a few months, is being cared for by her grandparents. They're working to gain full custody of her. Brian Sue.